Welcome to another early morning at Centennial Gun Club. We're here to look at the rental wall. We got a fresh target and some fresh breath. So let's see what we can do with this little 380. You know, one of the things that I really like about the Glock 42 is that most 380s are just teeny tiny mouse size. This gives you a little more to grab. It might not fit in a pocket as easily, but it's very comfortable to shoot. Let's look at the target. So we all know 380 has basically no kick. Um, and even with this tiny gun and tiny sights with very little effort, you know, A zone hits, a, what are this? Maybe what, 10 yards? You know, I think that's pretty respectable. That was the Glock 42. The Glock 42 is the only 380 that Glock puts out that's available in the US. There's also the Glock 25 and Glock 28, which are the compact and subcompact size that uh, can't be imported due to whatever rules and regulations. I know it's not a new gun, but I wanted to show it anyway because it's still really interesting to me. Back in the height of the single stack nine craze, the Glock 42 was released in 2014, and a lot of people were really unhappy about it. They had been calling for a long time for Glock to release a single stack nine, but instead they released this 380. I think that the Glock 42 only suffers from bad timing. I think it's a great gun. Uh, I tend to not like small guns and 380s are always really small and they're not comfortable to shoot. But this kind of splits the difference. It's, it's small enough that it's easy to conceal, but it's not so small that it sucks to shoot. I find it really comfortable. The, the sights are what you're used to from Glock, so it's kind of like if you shoot a Glock 19 all the time, it's just a smaller version. Uh, the grip texture is a little bit more like the Gen 4 grip texture. Same with the mag release. What do you guys think? Were you angry when they came out with a 380 instead of a 9? Tell us in the comments. Also, while you're down there, in the description, we have some links to subscribe to our newsletter and our print magazine. And make sure you like this video and subscribe to our channel so you can see more little gems from the rental wall. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you at the next one.